Shashank Panohar will be the new BCCI president. The man from Nagpur got all the six nominations from the East Zone and now is all set to start his second innings as BCCI boss. So what does Manohar's appointment mean to BCCI and India's cricket? Take a look. It's official now. Indian cricket looking to revive its image is set to appoint former president of the board Shashank Manohar as the next BCCI president at the SGM. On Saturday, as the board met in Mumbai to finalize the nominations for the president's post, it became clear that the Nagpur Supremo was the unanimous choice. All six zones nominated Manohar's name and after the completion of the scrutiny, he is once again set to take over as the boss of the richest cricket body in the world. All the association from East Zone nominated Mr. Shashank Manohar's name and seconded by many other members. So I congratulate Mr. Shashank Manohar. I hope there will be a restored in the bowl and I have full faith in Shashank that uh, he will do utmost that uh, all the board image up to now what is Tarnis will be in the uh, right direction now. With Manohar's appointment, the message of the board is loud and clear. Cricket in India has to be clean and ditto with the people who run the sport in the country. Shashank Manohar has an impeccable track reputation as a cricket administrator. He is known for his integrity in cricketing circles, justifying the predicate Mr. Clean attributed to him. He's often credited as the best president BCCI has ever had, as he served as the BCCI head from 2008 till 2011. He brings a lot of administrative experience. Along with that, he brings a lot of uh, integrity and respect for his name. Uh, he also has a very good uh, rapport with almost all the members of the board. What's also crystal clear is that Manohar will not put up with any nonsense that can tarnish or malign the sport. He has been vocal on various controversial issues regarding IPL spot fixing and has openly lashed out at those involved. Basically, the board does not have a choice with regard to Loda Committee report because the Supreme Court says that the report would be final and binding as far as the board is concerned. So, the board has no option. With Shashank Manohar's public criticism of Srinivasan making headlines earlier, this appointment can surely mark the end of the Chennai Supremo's run in the cricket circles. The mere coronation at the special general body meet in Mumbai on Sunday will probably spell a new chapter in board politics. With Rasesh Mandani in Mumbai, Sports Bureau, India Today. While well, Shashank Manohar is all set to start his second innings as BCCI president, our consulting editor, Sports Borea Majumdar, caught up with the former BCCI president, Sharad Pavar, who believes that Shashank Manohar is the right man to take BCCI forward. Joining me is Mr. Sharad Pavar, as always, a key member in the BCCI and somebody instrumental why Shashank Manohar today has agreed to take over as BCCI president. Mr. Pavar, why Shashank Manohar? We all come to conclusion Mr. Manohar has to take responsibility and we practically pressurized him and we told him just to save this game we have to come. So lastly, reluctantly, he accepted. But now I am absolutely confident that the entire world will be totally with him. There will not be any groupism, there will not be any size. He will protect the interests of every state association and he will improve the overall administrative performance of the board. Sir, there was so much of discussion in the media and uh, everywhere when Mr. Srinivasan went to see you in Nagpur about whether you will take over or you will support Mr. Manohar. There was a lot of talk in the what was Mr. Srinivasan sort of saying to you, etc. Can you just talk about that? Mr. Srinivasan came to Nagpur when I was in Nagpur and he saw me and he suggested Whatever the differences are there in the world, he said, he suggested that he wants basically to resolve all these things. And the first point he himself mentioned, he, he is not interested for any office. He is not candidate for any position, uh, BCCI position. And his total approach he communicated to me is that he wants the world should function smoothly and unanimity has to be there in the functioning. So he said he has no objection whether I should take over, 
Böyle sesen sürsek o. O yüzden ay sen istediğim decision you. Millet sesen onu sürsek o. Sir, final question. Like you have convinced Mr. Manohar to take over. If Mr. Manohar convinces you to go to the ICC as India's representative, will you go? See, that, that will discuss. We are not discuss with him. Basically, generally, BC says president should go. But sir, if he is requesting you, will you consider? Yeah, yeah. In fact, to cooperate him in every field is my responsibility. I will be behind the curtain. Ultimately, he will lead the organization. He is the captain.